how we do it. Already, bitch ass nigga, you know what it is. Really, nigga on the ground. And I'm rocking with that chest, not Jeffers TV, take ass now. Just not check a TV OGBC, man. Shout out to the chess team Marines getting that money today. Man, I woke up a little late today, man. First thing I see, like tap the phone on, pop smoke. Killed in home invasion, man. I'm like, damn, man. Then dude wasn't over 20 years old. The nigga was still a kid. He hadn't even. Damn, he ain't get a chance to do shit in life. You know what I'm saying? Damn, man, they said that boy had a party, house party, you know, at a little spot in L.A. or whatever. Right after the party, man, some dudes run up in there masked up, wind up gunning them down, man. They say it was a robbery, so I don't know if they came in after money or jewelry or whatever, but shit, they took his life in the process. You know what I'm saying, man? And, you know, that jealousy and envy, man, or niggas just looking for a leak. You know, man, when you be having on much jewelry as that nigga had on, and then you having a house party, that's letting niggas know where you going to lay your head. You know, if a nigga looking at you like food, man, you out of there, man. So, man, that's why you got to be careful, dog, when you got them having that bread like that to get money or, or, or you got anything of value. That a nigga that, that you feel like a nigga might kill you for, definitely don't let a nigga uh, know where you laying your head at. That's rule number one right there, man. I don't give a damn if you having a party, a wedding, bar mitzvah, whatever. Don't have it where you laying your head at, man. You go rent you a place out somewhere, man, and have that shit. Don't have that shit at the crib. Cause you let niggas know where you where you rest your head at. They coming to get you, man. You know, it's some niggas out here hungry, man. It's wolves out here, man. You know what I'm talking about? OGBC, man. Chestnut checkers move slow. Think fast, honey.